there's rumblings that Joe Biden should or may actually federalize the National Guard, take that power away from Greg Abbott. Let's say this showdown, I mean, this, that's what it is. It's a showdown. It's a showdown of power and loyalties and constitutionality. Let's say he does that. How many people say, no, you know what? Screw you, Biden administration. And how many people stay and fight with Texas versus the federal things? And does that put us on course for a force on force conflict? I mean, right, right now you've got uh, the federal agents that are cutting the wire, and then you've got the Texas National Guard on orders to put up wire. I mean, this is a, this is a, counter, uh, a powder keg worth of uh, tension. So it's, very, uh, it, 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 it's, it's a very weird situation. We certainly stand with, uh, with Texas on their right to defend themselves. Um, but Biden's going to be in a tough situation. Mm -hmm. So in other words, he's going to try to federalize these troops. In other words, put them on federal orders, and so now their allegiance technically goes to the president of the United States instead of the governor. Um, and of course, I think a lot of Texans, these are still, um, they're still yeah. Texans that are weekend, uh, you know, they're in the National Guards, they do one week in a month or when they get called up on duties by the governor. Mm -hmm. And uh, I think they would be in a difficult situation to protect their homeland or to follow what Biden's saying. Yeah, literally I, I open it. Be very interesting, but then, you know, then you've got Oklahoma and Florida and Tennessee, and you got all these other states that would send our National Guard uh, to help and, and to support the efforts of, uh, of uh, Governor Abbott. Because every state is a border state. You talked about fentanyl. Uh, the deaths in Oklahoma since I've taken office are up 500%. And we know that's coming across the southern border. And then you think about the terrorists. Um, again, I just don't know what their end game is here, and, and I hope American people really wake up to what's happening. Well, Governor.